Hi everyone, it's Polly from Polly's Priest coming at you today with a thrift store haul. Yes, another one. So we're going to start with what's out and what's here. I got this tray. I thought it was pretty. And it was originally priced 25 cents, but I got it for free because I didn't notice that it was cracked. So I'm still going to use it. I may just decorate the edge to help kind of keep it together. So anyway, there's that. Moving, background moving on, I found this package of what they call gift wrap. It was only 25 cents, and I thought it was really pretty. Let me turn it so you can see the flowers proper. There you go. Got that. I found a couple scrub jackets. Um, anybody who works in the healthcare field of any kind will know what they are. But I'm not going to use them as scrub jackets at all. I liked the, the print that's on them, so I'm going to use them for something else. These were 50 cents, so there's that one. <coughs> and there was this one, when I get it maneuvered around here. Um, and there was this one. So, oh, excuse me, my allergies are broken found this little like handkerchief it was 25 cents and I just love the pink colors on it so got that. Got a little ball of yarn that I just I'm a yarn person so it was only 25 cents so I got it then I have two skeins of yarn and they look the same color let me see if it says they are 242 242. Yes, they are. They're the same color, but they're called angel hair, and I'm sure it's probably going to make my nose itch, but I thought they were neat, and I thought they'd be great for crafting, so I got them. And this always means something good, and to me, something more than good. I love, like, teddy bears, unicorns, and stuff like that, so I found these, and I thought they were super cute. And my camera's not really doing them justice because they are kind of glittery. But I just thought they were really pretty. So those will have a little place in my craft nook. Or my bedroom, whichever one comes first. Okay. And then I got a little crazy in the uh, book section. I found three little golden books. One is the little golden book of holidays. Looks like it, so it was only 25 cents. The next one was the Golden Egg Book, again, 25 cents, looks like that. And the last one of this kind was the Friendly Bunny Little Golden Book, again, 25 cents. So I got those for crafting purposes. And then I've got some books for reading purposes. This is an Anne Rice book, and it's called Taltos, Lives of the Mayfair Witches. And I thought this might be a good read, because I like to read about witches and different odd things. So here's what it looks like. This was 50 cents. Then I found this book, which is by Phil Robertson of Duck Dynasty, with Mark Schlav Schlavbeck, I guess. And it is called Happy, Happy, Happy. So yes, we got that. I can't tell you where that's going right now because, well, that's for later. Then I found this one called Monster by Frank Peretti. And I figured it would be a good read for somebody here at the house. So. Oh, come on back here. Sorry about the crinkling. Okay, there we go. Then I found Gillian Phillip. And this one's called Firebrand. Looks like this. Figured it would be a good read for someone. And last but not least of the big books like this, I found this one by Tina Wainscott. It's called Unforgivable. What you don't know can hurt you. What you do know can kill you. Thought it was kind of interesting. We'll give it a read. Miss Roy, would you get me the gray bag, please, so I can show that? 
Anyway, she got her own special little bag, which is what we're getting into now. So, you can leave it on a the hanger. They'll be able to tell what it is. Because it might be hard to get off there. That's what the lady was having trouble with at the store, which is why we ended up with a hanger. Because you also don't want to rip it or rip the gloves or... She's trying to get off the hanger for you, folks. But it's being a little bit of a booger. Oh. Sorry about that, allergies. Did you get it or no? Maybe. And there's a little bag here we'll be getting into in a minute. Yeah. <laughs> here, let me see. All right, let me see if I can possibly get this off of this crazy hanger they have on. Because it's, what it is is they've twisted it up in there somehow. And I'm not, oh, I see what they did right there. Oh, I love when they do this. Not really. Okay. Now. There you go. I hate those hangers. All right. So, okay. Well, that's good. They're right there. What she got was a pretty winter scarf that's in a, like a burgundy red and gloves to match because she needed one. Put them in to be washed. And then, last but not least, if I don't dump it on the floor, is my little crinkly bag here, which I can now take this out of there. All right. So, let me get these kind of separated out so you'll be able to see what I'm talking about, hopefully. Maybe. Oh, work with me, you silly little bag. I really don't want to get stabbed, thanks. Okay. Well, you'll be able to tell. Anyway, this first bag has a little gold picture frame and a little gold bow in it. And it was a dollar. And I thought, well, for a dollar, that's not a bad price. And it's, of course, not going to get used for jewelry. It's going to get used for other things. But that's the first one. The second piece I found was 75 cents. Let me get it down in the bag. And, of course, my phone's going Please pardon me a minute while I answer this. Hello? Yes. Hey, Chris, are you able to go to Shop and Save with Dad? Huh? He says, yeah. Alright. No, I... No, we didn't. All right, bye. He wants you to go ahead and come over. Anyway, the second piece I got, I'm sorry about the phone interruption, was this pretty little uh, pen, but that's not what I'm going to use it for. Then the next piece I got <clears throat> is another pen, but it looks like that. And that was 50 cents. And then I found this little rose pen. Whoops, let me get it up there. For 50 cents. And then this was clip on earrings and a pen. And, whoops, they're trying to fall. They're really like fall colored. I thought it was really pretty. So that was 50 cents. And then last but not least, this was a dollar, and it's called a fashion brooch, but it's a little picture frame that's a heart. So, got that. And that is our haul for you all. Oh, and in case you're wondering what the blue and yellow is over here, my friend, one of my BFFs here on YouTube, um, Mr. David V, had sent me this beautiful bracelet, and it says love on this one, and then there's double hearts on this one, and then down here it says best friend. So, and since we went out today, I decided I'd actually start wearing some of the jewelry I actually have. So I wore those and I wore my little seahorse earrings. So, but anyway, that's our little haul I wanted to share. And hopefully we'll catch you guys in a while with another tutorial type video. So till then, be safe. And if you like the video, please like, comment, and subscribe. 
we would love to have more family and friends on YouTube always. And I hope you're having a wonderful day where you are. Please pay it forward and be nice. Bye-bye.